Ladies and gentlemen, children of all ages. Prepare yourself for the circus of style. Watch as horrifying horizontal stripes and freakishly frumpy sweatpants are thrown to the lions. And for the first time in what not to wear history, part mom, part wife, all clown. Meet Colors the Clown. Scratch that. Meet Alicia, mother, wife, breast cancer survivor, and full-time clown for hire. I'm wearing Calvin Clown today. It's hard to find out where it sort of colors ends and Alicia begins. I know. For the past 14 years, this 45-year-old mom of two has been providing for her family with her clowning career. But it's her kooky costume collection worn as casual wear that's been getting all the attention. Why are you doing everything in your power to distract people from who you are with crazy pants and clown clothes? Alicia now has aspirations to re-enter the corporate world. But can she separate the style of Colors the Clown from Alicia the Mom? Do you think that being a clown is all there is to being Alicia? I don't remember the last time I felt like that Alicia and felt pretty and sexy. Or will her self-defeating and self-mocking keep her from showing her true colors? I sabotage myself. It's fear of the unknown. I don't know where this is going to go, and I really want to find me again. So step right up. It's time to take this wardrobe from spectacle to spectacular. This, this is, is What Not To Wear. Here we are at the circus, Stacey, and we've got quite a scary situation on our hands. Yeah, I know. Clowns freak you out, too. They do. Mm. But that's not important right now. I'm talking about Alicia's scary wardrobe. You know what? She's really one tough clown. I mean, this woman has survived breast cancer, supports her family, and is re-entering the corporate world and needs a good wardrobe to go with it. Let's go talk to her friends and family under the big top about Alicia's big tops. <laughs> Hi, guys. Spending the day at the circus today, but every day is kind of a circus. <laughs> Alicia, right? Her life is a circus. So, Arlene, you nominated Alicia. Tell us why, even though it seems a little obvious. Yeah. Well, I like to see my friend Alicia look like an adult, not always so much as a clown. Well, I mean, you've been married how long? 21 years. So what did she dress like before she started dressing like a clown? Yeah, she worked in an office, and she used to get dressed up nice. Clown job took it all away. But Alicia, even though she's, you know, smiling as a clown, she's gone through some tough times lately, right? Yes. She successfully battled cancer. Breast yes. cancer? Yes. And she's had many obstacles in her life, and she focuses more on the family and her children and her husband and taking care of them. But since she had been diagnosed with cancer about a year ago, she really has started to develop a new way of living for herself. She's so, lost quite a bit of weight. Yes, she has. Yeah. What do you think sort of learning how to dress in real clothes again is going to do for like her? She wants to try something else, but she's like defined herself as a clown and she doesn't know like what else to do. One thing to be known is Alicia the clown, but from what we gather, she doesn't want to continue being a clown necessarily forever. No, not right? full time. So is that what you want for her out of this yeah, experience? Absolutely. I mean, to find a little bit more of who else she could be? Mm -hmm. All right, well, let's go get into place. Time for the circus, folks. Come on. Alicia has been invited to the Big Apple Circus to participate in a private clowning workshop with Grandma the Clown. Oh, my God. I love that. <laughs> Woo! But little does she know, her striped, over-the-top costumes are about to fall flat under the big top. Clinton. And we are from TLC's What, what Not, Not to Wear. Wear. Now, Alicia, your friends and family contacted us because they are seriously tired of you looking like a clown. <laughs> no offense, Grandma. With the help of your daughter, Rachel, and your friend, Arlene, we've been secretly filming oh you for the past two I'm weeks. Kill you. <laughs> so, we do actually have a surprise. I have a What Not to Wear card right here with $5,000 for you to spend on a whole new wardrobe. 
wardrobe. But, but wait, 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 there's a catch. Before you get the money, you have to agree to shop by our rules. And whatever we say goes, goes. Goes. Now, we'll let you keep any clown costume that for you might have for work. when you're at the circus. Yes. All right, so agree? what do you say? Do you want it? Come on, take it. Did you do it? You know, all that secret footage that we've taken of you, we would love to bring you back to our studios so that you can watch it and tell us what the hell you were thinking. Okay. All right. All right. Go yell at them. If I cry, I need some Kleenex. Oh, Kleenex. Kleenex. I can't even believe this is happening. I'm still quivering and shaking. I think I dress not so bad. I'm a breast cancer survivor. I want my outsides to match my insides to look the way I feel. And I want to show everybody that I, I'm okay. I'm a survivor. Woo! <laughs>